Hello everybody, so this video will be some update video on this battery which I make in my previous video. And the battery which I have here is this Zinc Audat Sand battery. For more information, the link to this video where I make this battery will be in the description. But know what I make with this cell is that I test the self discharge. And actually 3 days ago I fully charged this cell with a voltage of 1.5 volts and after charging I get the cell voltage of 1.4 volts. So, like I said, this cell I charge with a voltage of 1.5 volts. And on the first day, after the charging was finished, I get the cell voltage of 1.45 volts. After two days, I get the cell voltage of 1.35 volts. And after three days, I get the cell voltage of 1.34 volts, which is really, really awesome. And because this one is this zinc outlet battery, for this reason the cell voltage will be around 1.25 volts. Because the cell voltage around 1.25 volts is some typical voltage of zinc outlet battery. But for now this cell holds the voltage really really nice. And I still have 1.34 volts, which is actually really, really awesome. So after three days, I still get the voltage of 1.34 volts. So in this cell, I still use for the negative electrode, the carbon rod. But actually you can replace the carbon rod on the negative side with some zinc, for example. And remember, if we use some zinc for the negative electrode in this cell, the zinc can corrode. And actually this is bad because the zinc is acting like negative active material and the negative current collector at once. And if you get some corroded zinc, then in this case you can lose the contact. For this reason it's good that you use some carbon rod also for the negative electrode. Because the carbon rod will create some stable contact and will not corrode. So the zinc will go from the electrolyte to the carbon rod negative current collector when the cell is charging. And after discharging, all the zinc which is formed on the negative carbon rod current collector will dissolve back to the electrolyte. So actually this was my little update on this zinc Audat sand battery. And yeah, we we'll see us in the next video. Bye.